remember my first time, it's, it's my second time here at the Cedar's house of grace. And it's been from glory to glory. I remember the first time I came. It was heavenly. And I would trust the Lord again. What he has done today was a great time of worship. A great atmosphere, ready art. I you know you you can you can you can see the effect and impact of the world. This church is the is the world at church. Let me use that and just from glory to glory. It was a great time of worship. We we'll give God praise. So I believe that uh, on Cedar Cedar's house of grace, like the Holy Ghost spoke through us, I believe it's a time of explosion. Isaiah 14 verse 5, glory of the Lord shall be revealed. That's like an explosion revealed. When the glory comes, there are no words to say. But get ready for a time of explosion, not only for the church, for businesses, for every for everyone connected to this church. I need to be said on this church. So if you're struggling, go there. Things will explode. Damien. Uh, uh, many reasons why, I mean, many reasons, I'll just probably say one or two. And, uh, it, how can God call a man after his own heart without the mistakes he made? I mean, David said in Psalm 65, this which for you, God, in Zion. As a small boy, as a small boy, he, he defeated the old giant. I mean, what, what mentality did he carry? At that age, I mean, he will. He wakes up in the morning, and the only thing on his mind is to give God praise and worship. The dangerous man, he lived in law, but he was under grace. I mean, that was, imagine the things he said in Psalm 110. The Lord said to my Lord, "Sit at my right hand till I make your enemies your foes." How did he know there was in Jesus? I mean, many things he said in Psalm 68. The Lord ascended on high. I have led captivity on high. And they are led captivity captives. I and mean, how did he know these things? Like the man to study. He talked about Jesus. Talked about. He talked about not only about his 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 uh, birth. He talked. He talked about his birth. I think he's the only one who talked about his birth. Who sang about his birth, death, burial, resurrection, and ascension. The man. That's the man to watch out for. And. Lastly, one of the major reasons why I love him, he and his guys wrote 150 songs. We call them songs. The body of Christ is praying them, not even singing them. That's the efficacy of what they wrote. They wrote songs and we are praying them. All of us, different denominations, we can fight on all other doctrines, not our song. That's to tell you what kind of man this is. They wrote if you if you have a, if you have an issue and you're believing God, I'm sure you have a psalm that you are praying. Yet there are songs. Think about that. Trust me, Allah made oil. Allah made an oil magnet. I studied industrial chemistry. After school, I started my own company, and from um, to deal with more chemicals. I mean, so so I I will have been in the oil sector. As I know, oil magnet. Listen to me, you are missing. It's that simple. There's, there's, there's something about the atmosphere of praise there's, that you just, you know, there's, there's a river here, I believe. There's a river that you, you just come in and sway. It just takes you to different levels. You better get here. Don't miss the next um, sessions remaining. You need to be here. You need to be here. You need to be here. I, I'm hearing the Lord say is oil of joy. Oil of joy. Oil of joy. Oil of joy. Oil of joy for the spirit of heaviness. You need to be here. This is that season. And with joy shall you draw from the wealth of salvation. Don't miss it for anything. Invite your friends. Invite your family. And please come with an expectation. An expectation to praise him, to give him your all. An expectation not to be distracted. Give him everything you are. And what God do, do more than you thought he would do. Mm. God bless you.